out for a throw in. Taken quickly, here's Jonathan Smith. Diagonal ball out to David Buchanan and it picks him out as well. And he go on the inside to Mandeville, decides to play it to Tyson. He knocks it to Smith, who will shoot. Over the bar it goes, but it was a nice uh, bit of play there by Chesterfield. Refereed uh, in the National League throughout the campaign. He's refereed Chesterfield twice. And every time Chesterfield haven't won on those two occasions, losing to Woking at home and drawing with Hartley pull away. Thompson will strike from Stead's flick on, but it's an easy one for Schwangelau to deal with. Diamond. Oh, looking forward for Muldoon. Harrogate's top scorer with 12 goals. He knocks it to John Stead. He'll shoot. Easy for Schwangelau. Here is... Will Smith, a former Barnsley youth team player, signed in the summer and has been a regular in the side alongside centre-back partner Connor Hall. Fallerfield driving forward. Muldoon, around 25 yards out. He spun round Weston, but uh, there in his way was the Chesterfield defence. Diamond, Burrell on the overlap and receives it from Jack Diamond. He puts it in, decent delivery, Johnstead's header and Harrigan have got in front. Well, eight and a half minutes is about to get on the clock. And the side sitting in second place have got their noses in front. Harrogate have got two men in this wall in. George Thompson and Jack Diamond. They have got everybody back bar and Jack Muldoon, so they are worried about Chesterfield's threat from this. It's Buchanan who takes, he centres it in. And there's the header, it's a good save by Bounceshaw. Denies Will Evans, I think, who got it with the head. Liam Mandeville goes over to take this corner down this left-hand side. Can he pick out a man in blue from this, like Buchanan's free kick just a few moments ago? Delivered in, not a bad one. Belshaw with a punch to the edge of the box. Weston knocks it first time back to the corner taker, Mandeville. He puts it in, good delivery, good chance, and there's the header, it's wide. Didn't take a deflection. Goal kick is the answer. Both of them to have seen the ball a lot so far. Yarny gets it back, looks down the pitch for Tyson. That looks a good ball. Stepping in there is Will Smith. Bowl with the first time clearance. Back there with Chesterfield and Cropper. Here is Mandeville poking it through to Jonathan Smith. Chance to shoot, which he does. He shoots low. Bowl shall save. Dento lets it run. He gives it back there to Buchanan. The attack's not over yet, though. In it goes. It's a wave by Smith. Headed to Weston, who shoots, missed kick, Cropper's onside, goes down. Referee not interested, and then there's a Harrogate player down on the floor. And here's Ryan Fallerfield, who's going to see the game be stopped by the referee, so the physio for the visitors can come on and uh, give him some treatment. But uh, that was a bit of a an opening there for Chesterfield. Smith hit it, it was a good strike. Belshaw could only power it to Denton. Tried to hit it first time, it just sort of went past him. He calmly then knocked it back to Buchanan, who then put the ball back in. But even though they are one goal down, Chesterfield, there is a lot of optimism inside the Chesterfield half. He looks long for John Steady's intended target. Evans heading it behind. Buchanan with a first time clearance to Tyson. He gets up above. Warren Burrell, there's Mandeville, you had two players around him, but does get away from it. Smith plays it through to Cropper. He's going to take on Warren Burrell here. He's going to have to wait for the support. Goes on the outside, drills it in low. Denton! Warren! The big man, yet again for the spare eyes, puts it in. 1 1, and they've richly deserved that equaliser since they went behind. They've had all the ball, and they've made the more inroads to the goal. Denton's at it again, it's Chesterfield 1, Harrogate 1. Finds Yarny. he then prods it forward to Cropper, he goes back though to Will Evans. There is more of a calmness to Chesterfield to play than there has been. Denton to Tyson, really good flick, but he drifted wide for that. Tyson, making it through, chance for Mandeville, for Mandeville, it's 2-1! Liam Mandeville puts the chance away! They've turned this game on its head! Nathan Tyson 
who acrobatically played the ball through to Mandeville. One on one with James Bowshaw. Puts the ball in the back of the net. And just a few minutes ago, they were 1 0 down. Now, just a few minutes later, they've got 2 1 up. I've got two away games on the spin now. Chesterfield, Chorley at Victory Park on Saturday, and then they go to the Crabble ground and face Dover. Before then, they go to Maidenhead on the 21st of March, which is uh, going to be down in the diary as one of the big games of the season. Flicked on by Stepto through to Jack Diamond, who's got a chance at goal, saved by Jalau, and it's 2 2. Harrigan have responded, it's George Thompson who puts the ball in. We've got a fourth goal inside 34 minutes. It's Harrigan who get it, and it's George Thompson, the man who gets it. Chesterfield two, Harrogate two. Referee getting in a position where he can see if there's any pushing and shoving going on. Harrogate have got a lot inside that box. There are four that aren't in there. In by Thompson, floats it to the back post, drifting on in there, and it's headed away by Cropper. Warren Barley who headed it towards the goal. Luckily, Jordan Cropper was on the line to just uh, clear it forward and concedes a throw and quickly played by Pemberton, the manager, to Yarny to take the throw and quick. Mandeville to Jonathan Smith. The pass is dispossessed. Muldoon, Thompson on his right, plays it through to him. Did get it through the crowd of Chesterfield bodies. Thompson's pass to Muldoon was not the best. Hit by Lloyd Carey. Tyson has done that a few times when he's got a few bodies around him. He has just managed to knock it past them, whether it's around them or through them. He has managed to uh, do that well. Free kick. Delivered in by Mandeville. Floated in, in fact. Evans with the header down. Belshaw gets on the end of it, and the offside flag is raised. Not entirely sure who it is against. But the uh, linesman there, Blake Antrobus, says he saw a player in an offside position. Carey gets it from Fallowfield. Thompson, Fallowfield again, first time cross, goes to Stead at the near post. Evans getting his body in the way of it. Weston now clears it out for a corner. George Thompson was chasing him down and uh, Weston did manage to get on that second ball. Competing with Evans there, it did bounce off Evans, did go behind him, went on the, in, still in the box actually in fact, it was anyone's there, Weston though got there and just happily cleared it away for a corner, in by Thompson, floats it in in fact, and there's the header by Will Smith and it's just gone over the bar, Will Smith, moves it back to James Belshaw, Part of the side, alongside a few of the squad, still with Harrogate that got out of this, that got out of the Vanarama National League North in 2018 by the playoffs. Here's Jack Diamond now. He can play it to his right with John Stead. He goes in alone and it's in. It's 3-2. Harrogate lead is Jack Diamond with the goal. Will Evans going to Sam Barrett and saying that there might have been a hand involved. The referee not interested. And despite Chesterfield's protestations, it's Harrigan who's taken the lead. It's Jack Diamond who scored. His effort went through Schwanjalau, but hang on a second. Samuel Barrett, the referee, is going over to Blake Antrobus here to discuss whether that was a handball or not. He's telling Jordan Crawford to go away, so maybe the celebrations will be halted. Well, sorry, they won't be halted. They will be halted for now. The Decision has been made quite quickly between Blake Andrews and Samuel Barrett, and a handball's been given against the Harrogate player, so the decision's been reversed. Plays it forward. Carey with a chest control and then sending it forward. Yarny shaking off the challenge of Jack Diamond, but Jonathan Smith's pass is charged down by Lloyd Kerry, and he plays it on through to Jack Diamond. Cross goes in, good header, and it's in! It's 3 2, it's Johnstead with his head! It's deja vu, and there's nothing with, wrong with the goal this time!
A fifth goal has been scored. It's Harrigan who get it and it goes beyond Schwanjelau and into the back of the net. George Thompson on the ball now. He goes back to Ryan Fallowfield. He plays it to John Stead. Great challenge though by Will Evans. Got the ball and nothing else. Hutchinson plays it through nicely to Weston. Trying to get away from Hall who's going to have to come out to close it down. But Weston's cross goes all the way out of play for a corner kick. That's just five of them in there. Hutchinson looking for the short. Buchanan against it. Goes to the back post this time. Headed on. Tyson shoots. And it's in the side netting. He got the crowd up on its feet. Well, it was headed across into the feet of Nathan Tyson. He was having to hold off the challenge of a defender and he managed to get the shot away, hit it well. For a few seconds, I did think it might have gone into the back of the net. Telling his team to get out. He'll roll it to Nathan Tyson. Beats Ryan Ballerfield. Away from Will Smith, who knew he couldn't dive in. Ball goes on through to Fondup, who's onside. The easy ball's Tyson, who he finds. Tyson shoots. It's a great block, though, by... The... Harrogate Town left back Warren Borrell, it was a fantastic block, he came all the way from the left hand side Evans uh, cuts away from Lloyd Kerry gets a little elbow in the back a little afterwards Fondock wins the header down Weston with a chance to shoot and does it one. he's always not afraid to shoot is Curtis Weston but Chesterfield will push them all the way, there's no doubt about that Weston with a lovely ball to Buchanan takes under control, well good ball to the back post We'll go all the way through to Hutchinson. A chance, though, to maybe put it back in. He's going to take on Burrell. He'll put it in. Cross is still up to the back post. Dead to let it down. Burrell it in. 3 3. What a way to end the drought. Scott Bowden, his first goal in 11 games. And he's done it from the bench. Chesterfield responds for the second time tonight moment will he change in these final few minutes or stick with the players he's currently got on the pitch Denton is header from Janowski Bowden's in what a chance great defended by Barrow and it's a corner kick got there in the nick of time Denton with a really good flick on went all the way through to Bowden probably just a few seconds behind there trying to react to that Elshaw takes over Evans' head. Diamond takes under control. Looked like it was taken under control on the chest by Diamond as opposed to his hand this time. Diamond shoots, could say by Jalal. He was allowed to drift inside from that left hand side. Left fly with his right foot. It was a dipping low drive, which Juan Jalal got across his near post to tip past the post. Here's Warren Burrell now, Harrogate now looking to push on, get that winner as well as the host. Diamond inside of Cropper, then goes on the outside of him. George Evans with his left foot, it's in, they've done it! Would you believe it, they won it at the end! Jack Muldoon with his 13th league goal of the campaign. We have a seventh goal here at the Pro Act, and it's the Yorkshire side who've got it. Bitter, bitter blow for Chesterfield.